Our quest to find the self-proclaimed Yesu wa Tongaren, so as said to Mukuyuni village, Tongaren constituency and Bungoma county. <laughs> Here, we meet Eliud Wekesa with his angels and disciples. Salam sa Yesu. Amina. Eliud has hit the headlines for calling himself Jesus of Tongaren, something which religious and political leaders have strongly condemned and even called for his arrest and prosecution. Security agencies, agencies within Bungoma County to move with speed and investigate the character of Jehovah Wanyonya and Yesu Waitongareni so as to establish <clears throat> if there are any atrocities being committed against humanity by the cultic practices they profess. In a quick rejoinder, Yesu Watongren has now asked the governor of Bungoma County, Kenneth Lusaka, and other leaders to have dialogue with him and solve the issue amicably on his second coming, as he alleges. <laughs> Wekesa found himself in trouble after Bungoma County Governor called on the county security team led by Bungoma County Commander Francis Coley to move with speed and arrest him. I therefore call upon the national government to spare no effort in weeding out this dangerous breed of spiritual conmen across the country before they contribute to the further destruction of our societies under the guide the guide of spiritual redemption. The self-proclaimed Jesus is against the law on the registration of churches in the country, saying he has permission from his father to serve his sheep from all over the world. He however says that the controversial preacher Paul Mackenzie should carry his cross with regards to his cultish teachings in Shakahola. It's not acceptable that this man continues to cheat people. That Kimilili member of parliament, Didmus Barasa, has on his part called on authorities to conduct a mental examination on the self-proclaimed Jesu Watongaren and thereafter legal action taken against him for alleged radicalization. John Makuba, K24, Bungoma.